Let's have fun tonight and do some crafting. Who's all on? I have no idea. Is anybody here already? Brenda is in the chat. Brenda Welch. Hi, Brenda Welch. How Brenda. are you? Brenda Welch, Donna's Creation is here. She just oh, said hello hi, to Donna. everybody. Remember I told y'all to go visit her channel. Donna, I'm so glad you're here, sweet friend. And yeah, that's it. Everybody else is quiet. Bienvenidos todos a mi canal. I forgot to do a greeting yet in Spanish uh, last live. Uh, bienvenidos todos amigos y amiguitas. Uh, gracias por estar aquí conmigo hoy otra vez. Y si no sean, les, les invito que se escriban a mi YouTube channel. <laughs> Man, that's, I barely made it through that. I'm so glad you're here, everyone. So let's get to crafting. Uh, I had a bunch of people ask me how I made these carrots last year. They're meringue carrot pops. Uh, when I first saw these on Pinterest, I thought, oh, those are so cute. I want to make some. And I thought that would be so easy to make. Well, I tried it and I failed terribly because I thought I could do it on my own. Well, then I saw a video that uh, Dawn had with the pink tree. She is amazing, y'all. She, she was showing how she made them, and I thought, oh, Lord, I can't do that. So I didn't even try it. Well, I was in HEB later after um, a month or two after that. I was at HEB, and there was a lady, a cake decorator, uh, topping a carrot cake with one of these carrots like this. And I thought, oh, how'd you do that? And she said, come here, honey, I'll show you. And I came home, and I did it. I couldn't believe it. So... I came home after church today and I had to practice because I hadn't made these in a year. So here we go. Hopefully we can do this. You had a lot more people say hello, including somebody from Sweden. Oh, and, my friend from Sweden. And Welcome. Also, uh, Jessica. I can't say her last How to pronounce her oh, last Je name. Hi, Jessica. From, I'm so uh, glad you're here, friend. From the friend. Facebook page. Yes, yes. And if you haven't gone to visit her Facebook page, you need to. She greeted you back in Spanish. Hola, amiguita, que linda. It, she is on every day, either 1 or 1.30. Uh, so check her out. She you, makes some cool stuff because I see her posted on the Facebook page. Yes, yes. And she is such a nice person. And let me tell you, everybody in her group, they're so caring and loving. Uh, I, just, I just love her page. And I'm so excited that I've been able to catch her here lately. Um, in the future, I'm going to have to get a monitor to go like right here so you can see people popping up because you might recognize names more. I me. know that You've last... got a lot of hellos coming through, though. There was an interesting question from Sandra. Is, you are so creative. Is it something your mom passed down to you? Uh, my mom was a fantastic cook and a decorator, but mainly she worked for a doctor, and the doc she helped the doctor with his uh, parties and receptions. And I think that's where she got a lot of her ideas. And I got to tag along with her a lot of times. I was just going to say, when she says something, you need me to repeat it. Otherwise, okay. you're just answering. Okay. Nobody knows. It it's not going to work. Okay. Anyway, so, <laughs> yes. I've, I've always loved to craft and make things and do things. All right, friends. I've already got my spackle in my bags. And by the way, these bags are from that little kit from for $7.99, and they work great. They actually work great. I am using sour apple for the green. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Before I get started. Oh, my gosh. I don't have it together here. Um, I'm using for the tips... 2A for the carrot, and a 4B for the carrot top. And I'm for the green mix on top of the carrot, I mixed apple barrel, parakeet, lime tree, and a squirt of bright yellow to make this pretty green. And then for the carrot, I used Anita's Crafting Paint, orange. So, Let's get started. I hope this works, friend. I've been nuttier than a fruitcake all day today. Uh, let's get started and see. I had to make that one because when I got home from church. Sally said, get it together, woman. Thrifter, not hoarder. Do you know? <laughs> I know I, I see her on the live, so. Oh, goodness. You know what? I needed to greet some people, but I'll get and to Aunt that Curtis in a little. And Curtis says she's a carrot top, so. 
Oh, I love it. I She's love it. She's a carrot top too. Okay, so this is what I do. There's one, there's two, and there's three. Okay, I'm making this one kind of big so that y'all can see it. Then I grab the orange and I'm gonna put a dab right there. And I'm gonna put my straw right there. It doesn't have to connect. Oh, interesting. It doesn't have to connect, but it has to have something to um, be based on, okay? So here comes the fun part. <laughs> and what's important about this that I didn't do here, because like I said, wow. it's been it's been a year since I've done these. I didn't connect. I didn't connect this high enough. You need to, otherwise, when you try to pull it from your wax paper, it might break, you know? So I'm gonna try and do that here. This is all you do. And you can make them as big or as little as you want. Of course, I had a little bubble right there. Leanne, are you okay? <laughs> See how easy was that? Friends, you can do it. If I can do it, you can do it too. Do not be intimidated. All right, let's do another one. I wish I had y'all. That was quick already. I wish I had y'all here so that you can see. I'm going to put glitter on it. I haven't forgotten. All right, so let's do it again. Remember, it's like. You need to figure out a way to highlight some of these comments so later in the end you can read and read. Of course, you go back and you comment to people, but it would be nice to be able to talk to people and answer know, people live. Oh, I know, because. Um, Let's see, I'm gonna go ahead because I felt like they needed a shout see, out. We, we got a lot more people joined in. Oopsie Daisy, hi friend. I know that I missed your comments, but I did go back and read them last time. And Robin's Buys and DIYs and Crafting with the Heart with Gloria. Hello friends, I hope y'all are here and I hope that y'all are all doing well. And let's get to crafting. Let's yeah, make Robin another. Oh, hi Robin. Y'all, you need to visit. Her. Let's support you, each other, visit each other's pages and, and channels, and we all have something to, to share. I'm always learning something new from everybody. All right, here we go again. Put your dab there, and then you stick your straw. I don't stick it into the green. I don't think that's necessary. Of course, I could be wrong. And then I just kind of went like, that and they sell these tips in different sizes so you can make big ones and you can make little ones so um, just any size that you that you need or that you want to decorate with so um, there you go how easy was that and look how pretty that orange is what I did is I took the dap my Hanita was nice enough to buy me another um, can of this yesterday. And I, it, you know, it's fluffy white, like Cool Whip. So what I did is I put, uh, I got a little Tupperware bowl and I just uh, squirted the paint into it and mixed it up. And um, uh, that wasn't good enough, so I added some more orange. So you can tell that it's so pretty. And I would give, depending on where you live, I would give these 48 hours to dry. This one was, well, I set this one outside, but so I'm not going to. 48 hours to dry, just to be clear. Yeah, because. That's what you like to do? That's what you're. Yeah, because it depends on where you live. You know, like right, when we lived in West Texas, this that would. nice dry air. Yeah. And, but here it takes everything forever to dry. And of course I'm gonna sprinkle, I'm gonna sprinkle them with the, with my party blend glitter, the snowy surprise. Bling bling. Bling bling, if it don't shine, it ain't mine. It, Leanna, anybody commenting anything? Oh yeah, there's a lot of comments. Are they gonna, so are y'all gonna make some? I can't some, read everything fast I understand, enough. sweetie. <laughs> I'm just glad Eric has been working so hard. I didn't even think we were gonna make you, it tonight. You had a oh yeah, I've been wrenching for the last ten hours. Who? 
Oh, Lizzie. Oh, I'm so happy you're here. Oh, Mama Bear Lisa. Hi, I wish I could give you a bear hug. <laughs> so, what do you think, guys, when they dry and see how the back looks? Oh, yeah, where your dab is. You yeah, the dab spreads down, you know, and it, well, and on this one, I connected the straw. <gasps> oh, to the M to the G. Maybe well, you do need to Yeah, this. I was going to say that earlier because the straw kind of acts like rebar in concrete. Well, but let me tell you what happened. But let me tell you, when I first started making these and I did that, uh, every time I pulled one off, uh, because of the straw, it would break. The, the green part it seemed like so Look I don't oh that's another thing oh I'm so glad y'all are asking that I you have to take a piece of uh or what works for me is a piece of cardboard and I cover it with wax paper this wax one, paper mm -hmm. all over cardboard yeah this one was it's been pretty hot here today this one is pretty it looks pretty good already. But you just I'm, made that one earlier? When I came home from church, so about at noon. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because I was, I thought, I don't want to make a big old fool out of myself on camera. Because I hadn't made them in a year. But you can, like I said, they sell the tips in different sizes. So you can make big ones, little ones. Judy just, asked if you've ever tried using parchment paper. Yes, I have parchment paper, but I, I'm just uh, partial to the, I love the, the uh, wax. wax paper. Mm -hmm. All right, so these look so cute on all your decorations for Easter. Let me just stick this right here. Okay, friends, next, let's go on. I've been wanting to make an Easter, decorate a little Easter cake forever. Oh, let me see. I've got so much stuff all over the place. I don't even know where to put this. <laughs> put right Jeez. Uh, I've got to get it together this Ro week. Robin said, it's so clean. I'd have dap everywhere. Well, that's probably because she goes and makes the mess outside. <laughs> yeah. uh, uh, let's see. Jerry said, how do you wash your tips to reuse them? Okay. Uh, do not rinse them in your sink. That's a big no-no. What I do, and I learned this from my friend from Cindy, from Peep This, y'all. Cindy taught us to, uh, you grab grab one of these um, wipies. Butt wipe. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Turn around, Eric. <laughs> you grab a wipey and you just clean it off. I usually grab a napkin and try to take as much off. And then I, with the wipey, I don't even get them wet, friends. Just with the wipey, clean them, and they're fine. But if you, you're going to ruin your plumbing if you try to wash it down the sink. And I learned that the hard way in our laundry room <laughs> and at the ranch. <laughs> Angela had also said that making, like, those carrots that you made uh -huh. in a candy cane would be really cute, too. Oh, yeah. I hadn't thought about that. Yeah. Oh, I love y'all. Y'all are y'all inspire me, and, and and Lizzie's telling me to be nice already. <laughs> Hi, Lizzie. Picking up the slack of como, Debbie Williams. Como te quiero, Lizzie. Okay, I uh, already had this um, this little cake. This is three. Oh gosh, this is one, two, three. No, or six. Oh, I can't remember. Two, three. I think it's six of those rounds from Dollar. Uh, oh, the, from Dollar the styrofoam Tree. styrofoam rounds. Yes, I didn't pull them out, and I don't want to open that closet. Okay, so what I did is is I glued Can you see them it on the bottom side. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's yeah. What I was just trying to see. So just... what I did is is I glued I I glued six of them together. Let me get this little turntable. I glued six of them together. But when you glue them, friends, don't put the glue in the middle. I learned that the hard way. Put the glue on the outer side, to the, close to the edges, because when you're going to poke your pretties into the cake, guess what? That glue is going gonna, is gonna to give you a hard time. So when you glue them all together, I wish I would have pulled some out. 
uh, to show you. But anyway, this was white. This is what I used as the demo for um, when I made the Valentine cake. And uh, I just had had it there and hadn't done anything with it because uh, I knew I wanted to make an Easter cake. So I just got this. I've been using this for different projects here during this season. And I just spray painted over so the white. So did you just use the dap on there? Yes. Is that, you mm -hmm. use dap and then let it dry and then hit it with the spray paint? Yes, and you can watch that video. I made a Valentine cake and it turned out really, really cute. Well, uh, I was just found that interesting because I remember in past videos, you would mix paint with the dap to kind of give it a tint. That's for the cupcakes. Oh. Okay. okay. But anyway, so look, I sprayed it and the glitter still came through. Isn't that something? It already had glitter. And so, don't well, worry, I'm going to put I, some more I hate on to it. tell you, but that's how pearlescent paint jobs are done. Oh. <laughs> the sparkle's laid on first, and then the paint's laid on over it, and it shows up through underneath. Oh, my goodness. Okay. Um, what I, I don't even know what I'm going to do. I'm just going to show you that I have a bunch of stuff made up, and uh, we'll just go from there. And uh, Angela had also mentioned, too, that lollipops would look really cute with the, like, how you did the carrot. Yes, yes, and, and talk about lollipops. Let me show you this one. Uh, oh, there you go. Friends, let me tell you, <laughs> I didn't know how I was gonna make lollipops and uh, before I started working with clay, thanks to my friend Yanira. Uh, oh. I bought this mold. It was only $1.99 at, uh, let's see. Hey, can you flip it the other way? Oh, sorry. <laughs> sorry. Uh, I think I got it at Hobby Lobby and or Michaels. I think they both carry them, but but it's a hard one. It's not your silicone one. And I thought, oh, geez, this is not going to work. Well, let me tell you, it works. The only thing is uh, you put it in the freezer. I put it in the freezer. And uh, like on this one, I just had three different little balls of clay and I just pressed it in here and that I just pressed in here. After you take them out of the, the freezer, this I thought this was going to break, but no, it, you, you pop it out. And once you get that little edge popped out, the whole thing will pop out. So that's just a little shortcut. You know, I'm all about shortcuts if I can. What's Tammy talking about? Tamri? Who did the ornaments? Oh, Tammy, we love them. Thank you, Tammy. Love the ornaments. Um, let's see, what was I going to say about the. Okay, so. Oops. Well, you spray paint, the sparkle comes through, and that's where you left us last on that. Okay. So, I don't know how I'm going to decorate this, to tell you the truth. And I made this little, I knew I was going to put a little donut in front, and my little donuts that I had made. Um, already were too big. So I made this one right before I went to church and I put it outside because it's been real, real hot here. So is it's, that, it's is a perfect size. Is that using your nearest clay too? It's using your nearest clay. And that's oh. the, is that foam clay? Mm-hmm, foam gotcha. clay. I'm and trying the, to learn the lingo here so when people ask, I And know. friends, she's got all these sparkles. I just wanted to jump into the screen last night. I barely caught her. She was showing all the, uh, the sprinkles that she has in her new line. So be sure and visit her um, Facebook live and she's got them on there and she'll take orders. You just message her. Leanna just dropped the link, the Facebook link. All right. Um, All right. I love her. She's so sweet. I get distracted. So you got people that say they don't even do fake bakes, but they want to see what you want, you're going to do with this. I know it just, my husband said when it was white, he said, is that a roll of toilet paper? Did you glitter it? And Jessica said that there's a, what, what did she say? It just went away on my and screen. Kate Carousel store in uh, Arlington that sells a lot of the molds. Yeah, Kate Carousel store in Arlington that sells a lot of molds. Jessica, you need to take me there. We need to, we need to team up. She lives close to that Christmas store that we go to. Oh, okay. Nice. Yes. And I'm going to talk about her Facebook uh, group. Um, she is called uh, Jessica's Party Decor and More. I, she has got some of she has got some of the nicest people on there. And Jessica is so 
funny because she speaks in Spanish, she speaks in English, she talks to herself, she laughs, she's got a beautiful laugh. She's like us. Like we all only Oh, Cindy just joined the chat. Hey Cindy, we've been talking about you. <laughs> all well, not good. today. Yeah. I think we talked yeah. about her last I, I just said that she taught us. You that probably she, did say that. I'm trying to read and. Ay, Eriquito, ADD and, Eriquito. Yeah. Okay, I know I'm going to regret this, but I'm going to use these silly little, uh, the foam beads. I'm putting Mod Podge on the bottom because I just think that they'll look so pretty, but they're going to go all over the place and make me crazy. See now when you now <gasps> oh 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 whoa oh Dios me now I'm gonna be slipping and sliding around on the floor. You're gonna act like you're in one of those machines at the mall. Uh, well, what I was gonna tell you is when you put your paste or whatever your glue on that side, and then you can dip it into the plate. Maybe let's see. Well, instead of having to pour more. Maybe, maybe if you had more. Yeah, because that's how I did. I that's know. how I decorated the top of that. I know we're we're both tired. <laughs> oh I just hope God. I'm not shaking with this. I didn't use the gimbal today. I don't trust it anymore. <laughs> Keeps taking everybody on roller coaster rides. And everybody was like, "I don't like that." Well, I'm sorry. Friend. Yeah, I'm sorry, guys. It's not my fault. Uh, There's robots being lazy. Oh my gosh! I knew these foam balls were gonna be a mess. I just knew it, but I, they look so cute. I thought they looked Eastery. They're, oh, they're just going everywhere. And while I was oh. doing this um, earlier, I mean, looking at this, I got an idea. Uh, I, wouldn't it have been cute oh. to make a little Easter cake hat? Oh. Oh, that would be so cute. I think I'm electro electrically charged. You're okay. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> I just saw focus, Eric, <laughs> Jessica. <laughs> Uh. Anyway, Jessica's got some nice people uh, on the nicest people. So does Yanira. And I mean, I'm, and I'm talking about them because I happened to catch their lives here lately. Um, Jessica, because she's on during the day and I'm cooking lunch at that time if I'm home. But uh, so, I mean, I, like I said, I try to watch and support everybody that I can, but. And now you got creative chica halls in the chat. Hey, Tony, how are you? I love Tony. And if you haven't visit her channel, you need to. That chica, she's something else. Yeah. She, she goes and finds these bargains and she's just a joy to watch. And she's, she's a shopper and a crafter and visit her channel. It's creative chica's halls. Yeah, Tammy was, or how do you say her name? Tamara? Tamaray, sorry if I'm mispronouncing your name. She was saying the same thing I was saying, which is just, you should just pour them in the plate and then roll them around on there <laughs> instead of trying to pour I them know, over. But, you know, and then I, Jessica suggested putting a dryer sheet in the bag. I, I normally I do, and, did, and I spray it do. with a with, uh, static guard, but you know what? I That was a brand new bag, though, you just opened. I used a, I used the static guard on my clothes. It, I only use it when I go to church because... Sometimes my tops stick to my bahoogie. <laughs> so I, I, I used a bunch what of that static. body part is a bahoogie? <laughs> a boogity boo. <laughs> <laughs> Let's just keep going with this. I don't know where this is going. <laughs> figure it out. Okay, I'm going to leave that alone. I'm tired of these things. Let me see. Oh, my goodness. Did I have? All right. Let's continue. Oh, friends. You ought, to, you ought to spend some time with us. It's There's never a dull moment around here, let me tell you. And Gosh, I'm going to have to sweep up. It, it just drives me crazy. I don't like glitter on. I love glitter on everything, but not on my floor. <laughs> my husband sometimes has it in his hair and his eyebrows, and he doesn't even know it. Uh, He's over there napping with foam balls stuck to his face. <laughs> Pobrecito Janito, he's so sweet when he wants to be. Which that man been married to him going on 45 years. Never tells me no. 
Look at this. Okay. What falls is going to fall, and I'll just have to deal with it. Okay, so now where is the front? I think this is going to be the front. Listen, uh, I wanted to share with you that my friend Cindy with Peep This, y'all, she has been decorating some sneakers, like fake baked sneakers Cindy that you does. can wear. Oh my goodness, they are adorable. In case y'all haven't seen them, you've got to visit her channel. Peep This, y'all. She's amazing. Who can do that? I'm going to get her to make me a fake bake Air Jordan cake for my birthday. <laughs> she can do it. She can do it all. I know she can. I've seen what she sent you. I know. We get all excited when Cindy... Her, her shipping and packing skills are impressive as well. Because everything makes it in perfect condition. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, and we don't have the nicest male people here. Oh, we don't. We don't. In fact, Lissy, I was going to tell you, you sent me a beautiful gift, and I'm going to take pictures of the gifts I've received recently and post them on my Facebook group page. And, guys, if you haven't become a member of our group page, you need to. It is a page full of wonderful crafters that love to share ideas, and they're so nice, and I'm so proud of them. And it's free, too, and by the way. And it's free. We, know, we don't ever ask for money. I know. We don't. Uh, Lissy sent me the prettiest angel. It Oh, beautiful. But she sent it to me for Valentine's, but she had the address going to the ranch, our old address, for some reason, because I know she sent me stuff here. So um, our address is listed on top of our page or under show more or something? Uh, on the description box, but on the lives, I, I need to set them up on the lives. I yeah. haven't had a chance to really start. I know, because luckily the man that bought our ranch, he's so sweet. He's he um he brought it to me but like barely brought it to me two weeks ago but i love it lizzie thank you so much i appreciate everybody taking the time to send us gifts okay so i was inspired for the centerpiece to go on the cake by my cookie my dough ornament um but i just didn't think this was it was too thin to go on here so I'm i just to heavy too. Well, a little, no, little it, top heavy. It, no, it didn't matter on that part. Gotcha. But, but what uh, I didn't like is that it was too small. So I just went ahead and um, I had already created a pattern when I made that little stick of chicks right there, mm -hmm. of peeps rather. And uh, so I went ahead and cut one out of styrofoam and the little chick. I just used a little uh, cookie cutter that I had and. Uh, Cut that out, see, sort of, kind of, I yep. did use that. And anyway, I thought that's gonna work perfect. So let's see. Oh, it's gonna be so cute, I can tell you already. I don't even know what I'm gonna put on it, but what else? But I'm gonna so add a little- So setting them? I'm going to add a little glue right there just to keep it in place, just because. Oh, and these strings just get on my last nerve. Okay. There's another friend. Is she on Mary Ellis? Uh, I think I saw her name earlier. Mary Ellis, I'm telling you, she makes beautiful, beautiful fake bakes and a lot of specialty items. And she is uh, amazing. She has a Facebook group page or a no, Facebook business page where she sells a lot of her items and you will not be disappointed. All right. I think I'm going to put, I think, oh, let's see. I think I'm going to put a carrot. And what I did is I cut the straw and I add this little toothpick so that I can stick it in there. And first of all, I like to see how tall it's going to be before I cut. But I think I'm going to... Which way are you going here? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Playing w musical chairs with a cake. Yeah. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to pour those in there. Ha <laughs> ha. Let me see. Oh, 
Y'all, I get so excited. You gotta see me when I'm here by myself. <laughs> I talk to myself, I get so excited. Usually I have the music going or I'm watching somebody's YouTube uh, channel and uh, I'm talking to myself and I even answer myself. Okay. <laughs> Surprise, surprise. Look, friends, I made an egg sandwich out of the, the clay that our friend Yanira sent us. And um, it worked out perfect. I think I'm gonna put it right here. Look at that. See how well the little toothpicks work? And you can just play it by ear. If it doesn't work for you, you just, you just take it out and I think this needs to be closer. Glenda Bia said, hello, it's her first time watching a live. Oh, hi Glenda, we're so glad you're here and don't let us scare you. <laughs> Welcome to my vida loca. That's what I tell everybody. <laughs> oh my goodness. Let's see, how far do I need to go? I think I'm gonna add this right there. Oh, these webs. All right. Oh my goodness. Is this not cute already? Tell me guys, how's it looking? Is it cute? And you know what I did? I made some of these little, little things here that I think I'm going to put, Let's see, does it need anything else? Does it need maybe the ice cream cone up here? And nope. Leave it alone. Leave it alone. Yeah. Everybody likes it. Oh, Everybody I likes think it's it. so yeah. cute. It's going to look so cute on my counter. All right. So now, <gasps> now I'm going to, um, here's the white. I think I'm going to put just some little star. Um, Let's see. I know, that'd be great. And Lizzie said, Pre precioso. Ay, ella está muy preciosa, my Lizzie. Okay, so let me start right here. And I can't see what I'm doing, but I'm going to try it. I want some big little. Whoops. Oh no. Press it. Press it. Oh no. <laughs> Let me see. <laughs> That's what happens when, when it's already dry. See, friends? Don't do what I Is did. Is the whole thing? Or uh, just that fr front piece? Just that front piece. That's okay. You know what? I'm going to make it stay. Y'all watch. I'm a, I'll show y'all what I'm going to do here in a minute. Jessica said, I'm not the only one that talks to herself and answers myself with a question mark. <laughs> and Bonnie it. Overman said that that happens to her all the time. With the... Is Bonnie Mounts on? Who? Bonnie Mounts. Yeah, I think I saw her earlier. Hi, Bonnie. There's two Bonnies. Oh, Bonnie Overman. She is such an inspiration. Let me tell you. Looking at her, you don't know how old she is, and she'll tell you how old she is, and you're going to say, I don't believe you. I don't believe you at all. And she's been on the Good Morning America show. <laughs> oh, yeah, I remember. Yeah, I remember. Yeah, you told me about it. Oh, y'all, this is not working out. Okay, give me some advice, somebody. Uh, Cindy, give you advice. Yeah. Cindy? Look at that. What, uh, put a little glue? Bonnie Overman says she's 71 years young. Oh, she's beautiful. Y'all go visit her channel, Bonnie Overman. Go see that pr beautiful lady. She is amazing and she's always got some good ideas and she can really uh, knock out a tablescape in no time. I think that's why she was on 
like a contest thing. It, good morning, America. Do I cut this thing off right here? Yeah. Boink, did I <laughs> hit you? Yeah, I was wearing my OSHA approved safety glasses. <laughs> okay, let me brush some. Um, she said a... cover your tip. I think because she saw that coming, that you were going to launch it at me. Oh. I think it came in delayed. <laughs> there is like a one or two second delay too, guys. I, I heard you say, thought you said something else. Mama barely said the one reason I say I could never have a YouTube channel because this brain of mine would forget. Oh, uh, and, and she said. No, I couldn't see she, the rest of it. She was filming and there's no telling what I might say or change. Yeah. And then she said that if, if anybody trolled her, oh, I just forgot to do that and it worked so good. Darn. She said if anybody trolled her, she would lose it. This is what happens when you have two ADD people working together. <laughs> she said she would lose it. She wouldn't be as nice as I am. Uh, my brother, y'all, when I first told him that I was going to have it, that we started a YouTube channel, he said, Sissy, no. And I said, what do you mean no? And he said, People are going to be mean to you, and I don't want that for you. And I said, what? nobody's going to be mean to me. Why would they be mean to me? I just want to share, share my, my crafts with everybody. And he said, oh, sissy, I wish you wouldn't because I know you. And uh, y'all, I was calling him about a month later. <laughs> Nobody was so ugly to me. And I said, you were right. And he said, I said, but oh, well, I just kind of, you know me. And he said, well, did you tell him about mom? And I said, what about mom? He said, did you, oi, 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 oi. What, 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 what? It's leaking because I put too much. But oh. look, y'all, we learned something, even with Cindy not being yeah, here. Yeah, Cindy's tip of the putting the glue down. Yes, I forgot all about that, Cindy. Uh Anyway, I told him, he said, oh, it's looking wonky, but it's cute. <laughs> Angela said to just delete and keep on keeping on, but I tell her not to delete. She, she also has no filter. Oh, uh, but uh, let me tell you what, and then my brother said, did you tell him about mom? And I said, mom, what about mom? You know, my mom's passed for a while now. And he said, he said that, Mom would give everybody a blessing, and so when anybody is mean to you, tell them you're gonna give them a blessing. So if anybody tries to troll me, guess what, friends? They're gonna get a blessing from me. <laughs> so, man, my poor brother, he didn't want nobody to be mean to me. I really don't care what people say. Of I course, really, I, I, really I worked don't on a anymore. YouTube channel for a guy that was on television for a while, so we had a bunch of people, and they said a lot of mean things, but. I really How don't, can people I really do don't that? care. It doesn't bother me at all. Like, because it, it's just some jackass on the other side of a keyboard. Oh, you said a potty. I said one word. One word. But was friends, very nice. you know what? One time I got accused of stealing a pattern from a secret group, and I don't even belong to any secret groups. <laughs> hey, oh, my. Hey, hey, Cindy, that's what I have a buddy, Louie, and he always says, hate pays the bills. Yeah. Because all those people that talk smack, all their views and comments were going towards my paycheck, so. Oh, but listen, but that was just, you know, I haven't had that happen to me in a long, long well, time. Well, I, I had all doesn't. those years of experience of dealing with that, so when we came into your channel, we handled it we a lot We handled it. And I told Eric, I took care of that person that was ugly to me. I deleted them. And then he goes, you're becoming part of the problem. Don't do that. Don't delete them. Just don't even say anything. I said, oh. Then he chewed me out. And then I was real emotional. And I said, hey, can we film another video? <laughs> that, that's how bad it affected me. Oh, goodness. Let me see. Yeah. <laughs> Mama Bear Lisa, you and I would probably respond the same way usually. Actually, I have mellowed this, out a lot. This is me like sometimes when I don't have anything to say, it's because I'm just minding my manners and it's not so letting funny. my mouth get the better of the situation. Oh my goodness. Let's see. Danita is here. Oh, hi friend. 
Yeah, Nita, Danita Anderson. Yes. Hi. Oh, guys, go visit her. She is a joy to watch, and she's so talented. She's like everyone that's my friend. I love everyone. Y'all are so talented and so creative. You'll have something to share with us, and y'all are sweet, and I love y'all. I love everybody that I'm friends with. And I love everybody that belongs to our Facebook group page. Y'all are so sweet and so helpful. That and a lot of times, friends, I can't get to uh, checking the page right away. I don't. I don't deal with any of the. We have somebody that deals with the um, approvals and all this ruckus and all that. So. <laughs> any. Anyway. <laughs> Yeah, so so um, just be patient. A lot of times, I mean, it takes me a while to get on there. I try to check it in the morning and then at noon, but some some weeks we're so busy that... I know, and you and I are the only people here that don't work 40 hours a week, but yet somehow... <laughs> we're so busy. Yeah. I okay. don't know what I would do if I had a 40-hour-a-week job. I wouldn't oh be here, gosh. I guess. Uh, we're so busy and we're going, it, since we live out in the country and we live in a town that doesn't have a lot of big stores and stuff, so we have to go into town and for doctor's appointments, dental appointments and stuff, it just takes up our whole day when we leave the house. All right, where am I going to put this chick? I want this chick, I want grass right here. Maybe I should. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm gonna bless them. <laughs> oh man, I tell you, it, it was, it's. I'm glad that we're past that. Stage. She'll bless them, but her mom will haunt them. <laughs> yeah, my mom. <laughs> There's, yeah, that's who I get it from. Your mom. She's uh, a savage in the family. <laughs> she was hilarious, though. She's, yeah, she didn't, she didn't. She wasn't very nice. Lena asked if she ever liked anybody. I said, besides me, I don't know. Oh, my mom? Yeah. Yeah, she loved people <laughs> that were nice. <laughs> well, then that's kind of like me. I like other people who are nice. So. Yeah, she did. I remember she was in the hospital, you know, before she passed, and she uh, she had asthma <laughs> real bad, and the lady came to give her a breathing tra treatment, and young nurse or and uh she said to her oh honey you're so sweet i'm gonna give you a blessing let me bless you and she gave her a blessing and then the other nurse came in and she goes you're not getting a blessing because you're not very nice <laughs> so there i was i'm so sorry <laughs> She said she's so funny, and I thought, oh, I'm glad you didn't take it personal. But when people are talking to the small towns they come from. Mm -hmm. I had well, we at one point I, when I where I went to high school, the town only had 900 people in it. I graduated with 22 in my class. Yeah, it was nice working for that school district. There's just, only 10 kids to a classroom. <laughs> does her audio sound okay? Because her mic it's pointed directly in at her. Can you adjust your? All right, cool. Okay. Sorry. Okay, I'm just gl gluing these little accessories down here. I don't know why, just because I feel like it. Just because I'm having such a good time with y'all. Pamela Page says her four-year-old granddaughter loves watching your videos. Aw, that's you know, so sweet. I meant to read it. Somebody <laughs> at the very beginning of the stream said that their four-year-old... But it might be the same. I thought it was the... Grandson, though, at that point? Uh, Maybe I could be wrong. I don't know. Why do I feel that this is wonky? There we go. Okay, so it's not enough that I've got all this stuff on here. Somebody asked, what subject did you teach? I Hey, I taught everything. Pre-K, yep. uh, art. Art is my favorite. I loved art. And, um, you know, in that school district that he's talking about, Wink, that we lived at, they... Their fine arts had the, oh my gosh, the best plays put together by. Well, we had all that oil money and not enough kids, so. Yeah, it was 
man, it was like New York Productions, you know, the Christmas plays, and the, it was nice. Um, but then, when we moved to Midland, I went, I thought, I'll try just to sub to see what it's like. I got thrown into a classroom in high school, in a, um, it was a history class with 34 kids. Oh my God, I couldn't wait for the day to be over. So I decided I was not going to go into a classroom anymore. So um, I did, though, for a while. And then I went on to uh, the staff part of it and went to. I, I, I mean, I was at different campuses, and then I went on to central office. After I retired, I rehired, and I loved working HR and payroll. It, it, was, it was a lot of fun, and they have some pretty awesome people in Midland, Texas, in West Texas to work with. So, okay, um, let me see. It's not enough that it's already got a lot of stuff on it, but... You have somebody watching the UK. It's 2 o'clock in the morning almost. Hey, welcome, friend. Like they said, they woke up with a tummy ache and saw that you were streaming, so now they're watching. Oh, oh my goodness. What's good for a tummy ache? I think somebody else earlier, too, uh, Miss Janie, said that she was watching from her hospital bed. Oh, no, Miss Janie's in the hospital? COVID. Oh, she's sick in bed. Oh, sick in bed. Okay, my bad. I just... I'm so sorry, friend. Put her on my prayer list. Um, this morning, it's so funny because I... Put her on I, your prayer list. What am I, a butler? Jennifer Turney, my three and a half year love watching Joanne Randich. <laughs> hey, that's good. That was close enough. You know what? A friend of mine, it's so funny. She, Her little girl, she said, I want to watch Crafty Queen B because that's what I thought I was going to call my channel at first. And then they asked her for Halloween what she wanted to be. And she goes, I want to be Crafty Queen B. I need an apron. <laughs> I just thought that was so funny and so cute. Okay, you know those little foo foo ball, those little, you know, when I when I gather up the little um, the little poofs, uh, make those little poof balls. I made some for the cake, and I'm just going to stick them right here. I need another one for the back, just to cover up the empty, because you really can't. But there's glue there because this won't go down. Maybe I better just not try it since it's all wet yeah i'm gonna end up breaking it don't break it yeah i'll oh. let you deal with it yeah because i'll get mad at you if you break <laughs> it so will the comments i'm sure too <laughs> <laughs> is it dark already outside there's barely any light left oh because i wanted to show them the carrots that i made for my door doors well, but I'm going to make some little ones. If, if we you're going to show them, you might take a break from that and show them real quick. Oh, this is too too high. It needs to come lower. Oh, well, I don't know. I'm afraid to push that donut down because it's... I don't know. What does it look like to you, Leanna? Looks like a cake. Uh, looks like I want to eat it. Oh, it's so cute, isn't it? Let me see what color of... Um, Maybe a little blue egg. No. Maybe a little. Well, not pink. Purple, maybe. Nope. Yeah, because it's it's heavy on my. All right. Let me just stick a green one. Y'all, I love this glue gun. I had it outside my front door yesterday because we have had some really bad thunderstorms and it blew all, my, all of my garland decorations off out in the wind. I only had one egg left and two peeps and that was it. Garland was all hanging off. So I kind of had to make do with what I had, but I, I don't want to show them everything. I just want to show them the the uh let's go outside and i just want to show you these big carrots i made for my front door let me turn some light on a little bit that's all right right there that works something look oh here let's go oh. 
Well, it's kind of oh. dark already. But there's still some daylight. The phone will pick it up. Yeah. Oh, I'm not ready to show it all because that still needed to put some stuff on the oh, corners. Well, but anyway, you have to put uh, that in the editor's notes next time. <laughs> Friends, there's that carrot that I made. I'm so proud of myself. I just love it. Love it. You can do that too with the jigsaw. This was so easy to cut out. And then it's mounted onto. Oh, did you make that out of plywood? Yeah, look. I know I did it when you weren't looking. <laughs> and I did pretty good. Nice. Yeah. And then it's it's your daddy mounted it on a little piece of um, two by four, is that what they call it? Down there. And I just put the moss on it. But it's so cute. Oh, and I made these out of uh, cardboard. Look, friends, they're so cute. I had to put something up here because um, what I had here got blown away. <laughs> and it rained. And see, I made a, a purple one and then that turquoise one. But look at the carrots. I decided I didn't want a wreath and I should have gone a little bit bigger on the carrots, but I'll do that next time. But I just thought they were so cute. Love, love, love it. Yeah, I did manage to find one of the eggs. My husband found it close to the fence <laughs> by the cows. But anyway, that's what I wanted to show you. And this is made out of matting board. Matting board is so easy to work with. And oh, so was it already orange? You didn't have to paint it? No, I painted it. Oh, you did paint it. I'm gonna paint a little one. You well, know, I know you can get matte board in colors. That's why I was, I it, didn't know. It, yeah, they make it in colors, but boring colors. Oh. <laughs> I think, I don't, know. I don't know. I've always painted on it. But you can do this. You. It, if you think that you have to have wood to decorate, make decorations, no, you can use matting board and you can use cardboard. And see, these have been out here uh, since, oh, I don't know, I had them before the storms and now I have them again. So, I mean- and Amy Timmers asked where you find the matting board at. The matting board you find at, I get it at Hobby Lobby. Um, and it is, I can't remember, I bought some on clearance. Elena Salza said, the Texas winds here, eh? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I don't miss the West Texas winds. See, that's another thing I want to show. I have, these were, um, this is cardboard from last year. And I just glued a little stand on it because I used it as a centerpiece on something. And look, and all that is real um, confetti on there. And I, I just put it in the garage and it, it did well. So... I made a bunch of these last year anyway. So, um, all right, let's continue right quick. So what I'm gonna do with this little cake, who else is on there, Leanna? What, does, what else does it need? Does it need anything else? A lot of people, there's 180 people. Oh, goodness. Hi, everyone. In case you're just now joining us, we're having a great time. I'm making my little Easter cake that I've been wanting to make for forever. And uh, what else was I going to share with them? Oh, y'all. Hey, while we're taking a break. We're taking a break? <laughs> I didn't get that memo. <laughs> Remember at the last live, I introduced my husband and we sampled this... Um, these peanut patties that were sent to me, homemade peanut patties. I know a lot of people are allergic to peanuts, but if you're, if you're not. <laughs> if it'll kill me, then give it to me. <laughs> if I'm allergic. <laughs> anyway, this is the best peanut patties. Oh my gosh, they're not hard, they're not soft, they're perfect. They are sold by a mother and daughter. Um, <laughs> Look at that. That's how good they are. I had to hide these from my husband. Let me grab this better. I'm shaking the camera. You know, I had to hide these from my husband. He was eating them all. Uh, but I just wanted to share with you that I spoke to, it's a mother and daughter uh, that sell it. And she, let's see, she gave me her info. They are so nice, but it is so good. And it's so um, inexpensive. Okay, you can get, a, that's a $10 bag. You can get a $5. dollars dollars Yeah. That's for a great value. That it is. And Hell, plus, anything else you buy these days is just full shipping. of air. I'm going to order a bunch for gifts for Christmas. Uh, that's, 
I mean, that's a bargain for how good it tastes. I know you can't taste it, but... You can't taste what? What we're tasting. <laughs> oh, they can't? Yeah, no, they can't. It's good, but trust us. It, it's good, and it's... Um, the daughter's name is Angie that I met, and um, it's Grandma Honey's Peanut Patties. <laughs> What? Sorry, somebody said, I'm surprised your husband didn't finish them, but that's because you hid them. <laughs> I hid them, and I hid them very well. If, oh, he would have He would have finished them before that stream was and over. And he'd, he'd go to bed, and he'd be skinny the next morning. He didn't ever gain any weight from eating sweets. I know how uh, that feels. They're from Grand Prairie, Texas, here in the Metroplex area, and the bags sell for 5 and $10 plus shipping. She said kind of no more than, like, it depends on how much you order. Uh, they make everything fresh within a day or two of orders. And the, you place an order by uh, calling them on the phone or texting them. And uh, their, uh, here's their phone number. But Elsa what I, Hernandez said, Porecito. <laughs> Hola, Elsa. Amiguita linda. <laughs> mi mi uh, Esposo es una hormiga. Es una hormiga pedora. That's what my mom used to say. Because <laughs> he loves sweets so much. Le gusta la cosa dulce mucho. But they're so good. And um, I don't know. I just love them. They're on, you can find them on TikTok. Grandma Honey's Peanut Patties. And I wanted to say hello to my friend Sandy Crosby. Is she on, Leanna? <laughs> She had a birthday this past week, and I talked to her every week. She shared her story with me one day. Uh, really, she shouldn't even be alive, she said, but God gave her a second chance. And she's just a wonderful person, and I pray for her every day. And uh, we stay in touch during the week. She's just lo just a lovely person that I've met in this journey. And uh, she... Uh, she had a birthday last week, and I just want to wish her a happy birthday. And I wanted to tell you, friends, my birthday is May 29th. If you send me a birthday card with your birthday information on it, I'll send you a party. Party in a package. You're spoiling it. I, I was just backing you up there. I thought, I thought we were coming in hot on that. I, I know a lot of people sent me cards last year, but they didn't include their birthday. And and it's okay if you don't want if you don't want me to know your birth. I mean, not I don't need to know the year. Please send me your birthday, your social security, no. <laughs> <laughs> what your childhood house street address is, and no, no, no okay, never mind. No, Angela but, says she lives in Roanoke. She used to live in Roanoke. Oh yeah. Oh wow. Me and my wife. When they we first lived moved there. to DFW in 2010. That's where we lived. You know what? I have... Where is it? Oh, you know what? By the way, not sponsored by that at all. Those people were just nice enough to send us some stuff. Who is? Brenda. Brenda North? Brenda She said her daughter's birthday. Oh, her daughter's birthday. Oh, we have a connection. May 29th. You know, I, I wanted a big Mexican fiesta because I'm going to be 65 and uh, who knows how many more birthdays I'll have. But, I know you're starting to sound like your mom. <laughs> but, I but, heard that for almost 40 years from her. <laughs> My mom lived a, a good long life. She she passed away at 92. But anyway, uh, now you made me forget what I was going to say. Oh, I wanted this big Mexican fiesta because the kids gave me one when I turned 60. And I had so much fun. And my, all my friends were there. And we had, we had, we danced to the oldies. And we had a piñata. And we just uh, drank margarita. We just had a uh, great time. Uh, if you guys want to see the visual, Leanna, you can insert that video. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. Yeah, 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 no, yeah. No, no, no. Yeah, and somebody else said something. I lost my train of thought, too. You, oh, Barbara Townsend said she, she didn't believe you're 65, that you look great. And I was going to tell her it's probably her apron. Oh, yeah. It's, it's her apron that's making me feel uh -huh. and look young. Uh, but <laughs> anyway, so... I'm I, getting called chamaco now. Ah, <laughs> este chamaco no se aguanta. Oh, my goodness. But, friends... Um, 
I, I thought I wanted this, and I really wanted our friend Shorty to bring me to my party in a low rider, and I wanted him to bounce me up and down in a low rider. And oh, I, yeah, she's I, talking about Shorty from the TV show Shorty's Customs. He is so sweet. I I'm love him. With him. Anyway, so, but guess what? We changed plans, and I'll share that with you later, and maybe I'll share that that trip with y'all. We changed plans. Um, we decided on something else instead. I mean, I'll still have a little get together with my friends, I know, but um, I'm not going to have anybody bring me to my party in a low rider like I had planned. But oh well, maybe next year. You're going to be on a plane. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to be on a plane. Friends, what do you think? Did this turn out okay? I think they're ready to see whatever crafts you got. I just can't get over this. This is cute. All right, I may do something different to it or add to it or whatever, but I'll post a picture. Remember, friends, I know some of y'all aren't on Facebook, and that's okay. Uh, I understand. But if you have a Facebook account and you're not on our Facebook group page, you need to join. Yep. All right. You got Yanira saying, what's up? Hey, Yanira. I love you. I love. I can't wait to order some sprinkles from you. I love... Hey, don't don't th don't let this look like there's a bunch left. <laughs> it's a, they're, they're little half packages. <laughs> Busted. <laughs> but anyway, they look good there. But yeah, I've been telling everybody about you. You are an, a talented, talented, creative person, and you're so nice. And the people on your channel are so nice as well. And I love that. I just love that because we all need people to be nice and to be creative and to clap for others. Like Jay once said, my friend Jay, if you don't clap for others, it'll never be your turn. And that's true. Exactly. So, I've always been that way with oh. all my friends. Everybody <laughs> helps carry each other yeah. to the top. Yep. Mm -hmm. Here, Leanna, somebody, I saw somebody was asking about this info. Yep, somebody was asking about the phone number for the... Oh, uh, I'm, I'm not... Listen, this is a bargain. I cannot believe how the taste... You know, because I've had I've made some before, and it could break your teeth. But, All right, lady. But anyway... You did a 10-minute bit for that. Okay. Let's go. All right. <laughs> All right. I'm also her handler. Got to keep her going. <laughs> All righty. Okay, friends. I was going to show you... Let me grab my... Um, Matting board. Oh my gosh. I get so excited about happy mail. <laughs> I, I get so excited about it. doesn't matter what it is, whether it's a card or a hello or whatever. I get so excited. She is so sweet. Y'all need to go check her Facebook uh, page out. It's Designs by Yanira. And like I said, with her new line of sprinkles, wait till you see them. I caught oh, you late last. Huh? I caught you late last night, but um, I know she was doing a giveaway of sprinkles. Um, I think somebody that helped her out was giving away some. But she was showing them, and I could. I just wanted to. I wish I was there to see them in person because they look so cute. All right, friends. This is matting board, and when you buy it at Hobby Lobby, I got this on clearance though. See, it's 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 thin, but it's it's stiff, and it comes in a big old sheet like I don't know, just bigger than a poster board size. And I really don't know how much they sell for these days, but I think I'm gonna do a little video and just say. Look, friends, when you go to Hobby Lobby, Just this is... Just when you go this next week, yeah, doc document it. Yes, I'll document it for you because uh, it's back there where they do the, the pictures mm -hmm. and everything. That's why I know where it's at. But I bought, I happened to buy two of them real inexpensive. I forgot for 2 or $3 or something like that, too. But you can make a lot of things with it. See, I made a little carrot, like those big ones outside. These um, carrots are from that matting board and you can either use them on a wreath or a garland or like I said look at my the ones in my front door I wish I would have made them bigger but I am going to make some bigger ones these are going to go on a garland I have but I just wanted to show you how easy it is to paint on these uh, this I just put two coats of 
pumpkin orange. And look how pretty that is. And then the, I used the, nope, the sour apple. Where is the sour apple? I used apple barrel right sour apple, okay? There you go. And I just want to show you how quick you can detail this. All right, it dries real fast. Do we have time, Aaron, to yeah. detail this one yeah. right quick? Okay, because uh, I know he's tired. He's been working all day. Him and Leanna. It's just a little bit. Uh, I don't think it's a little bit. I think it's a lot. Well, I mean, 10 hours, 10 hour a day is kind of a part-time day for me. Yeah, I'll go back and look at the comments and then I'll say, oh, I wish I would have known they were there. I wish I would have. So yeah, we need to get some kind of. Um, but then you're going to be looking at the screen the whole time and you'll never get anything done. Ay, Dios mío. <laughs> Oh my goodness, yeah, you're right. Better not. <laughs> Sorry, friends. Okay, I'm just taking some white paint. And you can't go wrong. This is just one of these, uh, just a little paintbrush with a pointy tip. It's thin, it's not really thick. And I'll kind of go like this. There's no right or, you know, no, you can't go wrong doing this. Just try it. And on this one, I'm not even, like I said, it's just, just, I'm doing a quick, doesn't even matter how it comes out because it's not going to, it's not going to look bad. It, it's all because of the detail. Is that the train I hear? Mm-hmm. Train. We don't even live close to the the train tracks. What are you talking about? They're right down the street. Literally. But they're not that close. They're close enough. Not to we me. We live out in the country. Sound travels. Not, not to me. I'm just... Okay. And... Just water your brush down a little bit. Make sure the paint doesn't get too thick. Because it's not going to matter in the long run. Because... This is all about the dots. The dots make this project. See, if you get um, a long tip brush like that, it makes the curly cues for you. Boy, I had never heard the train that close. I hear it all the time. It's because we've always got something, music, TVs, everything going. Okay. So once I did that, just dipping in water. Yeah, just cleaning my brush off. Mm. All right. Um, and what I did is I got this white tip right here, and it looks kind of wonky because I had it out in the hot sun drying right quick before we came on. Because I thought, ah, oh, I'm going to show them how we did this right quick. Only because some people. What do you call that brush? It's just a little round tip brush. Oh, okay. A sponge, a sponge on a on a stick. That's what it is. This one's just going to have four because I'm just showing. Well, maybe I'll do another one right there. And doesn't matter if you don't get it all. Have you ever heard the term Cutter. less is more? Uh-huh. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's okay mm -hmm. sometimes to just do four. Yeah. Okay, so dip that in there. And then, let's see. I got the, what color was it? I think it's the pink eraser. Normally I would give it a little time to dry, but I think it'll be okay. You make a lot of stuff out of that one sheet. She watch it already. <laughs> uh, and some of my really, really fun, wild friends had already left before we did a bunch of that. So, <laughs> Gosh. I can't believe y'all put it on there. Why did I even mention it? <laughs> Donna asked how you kept on adding yours. Oh, that's what I was going to tell you. Um, you need to get you a pair of these big scissors. And you can get these at Lowe's or 
Hobby Lobby probably has them. They're probably, I don't know, but these are, I cut everything from plants to you name it, and, uh, wire and stuff. These are good scissors, but they cut clean. And that's what I use because you can use regular scissors, but your hand is going to hurt. I promise you. Okay, that's all it takes on that part. And see how it's coming together already? Looking so good, I think. <laughs> you may not think so. And then I'm taking um, Aquamarine. And again, I'm using that brush. Wee. All right. I didn't get all that. What was the last so bit of that the question? Matting board um, holds better to outside elements more than cardboard? Um, I don't know. I've used them both. I've never had a problem with them. Yeah, but you're not, your stuff isn't in direct contact with weather because it's always under a porch. I wouldn't, I wouldn't let it get wet with rain, like full blast rain. That's all I did, did a little swirl there. I'm just saying how cute it looks already. That's me. I'm so conceited. I'm sorry, friends. I just think it's cute. Um, all right, and then I'm going to do the purple or the little aqua. I needed some darker purple, but oh well. All right. Somebody said miss some of the video. Yes, if you're just now joining, you've missed 70 minutes. Oh no, wow. <laughs> I'm glad you're here, friend, anyway. They said that they'll have to watch the replay. Watch the replay. And you know what? I'm so grateful to Eric and Leanna that they can do this for us because they've been so busy. We haven't been able to film a video, but um, we have done two lives back to back almost. And I'm just very grateful for my son and daughter-in-law that are able to do that for me. Cynthia Way said hello. Hi, Cynthia. Oh, I love my friend Cynthia. And where's my, my Debbie Williams? <laughs> Cynthia, what's, where's our Debbie Williams? I know she's got a lot going on. I sure do miss her too. Oh, let's see. All right, then I'm gonna take some, um, some of this lime tree. What is that, lime tree? Lime tree, apple, apple barrel. Apple barrel. I really needed a, a darker um, one as well, but oh well. This'll work. I'm just gonna show them briefly because I won't be able to um, to do the Mod Podge on it. Oh, I see. Because it's not going to be dry. But see how just adding a lighter and a darker shade, y'all, anybody can do this. Y'all can do this. And look how the look it gives it. It's just, I don't know, I like it. It's wild or something. See? And then when it dries, all I did was I took a, a um, yeah, like a sponge, sponge brush. Mm -hmm. And you sponge brush your Mod Podge on it, just one, one layer. And then you sprinkle your glitter on there. Deb Ferris asks if you'll be posting a pattern for the carrots. How do I do that? You can go in and edit after the live is over on the description. So we can still put a link to it if okay. you upload it. All right. Um, I, this is not perfect, though. I just kind of drew that in a hurry this afternoon. And you ought to see how I draw, friends. Oh, my gosh. It's like, okay, I'm going to do this. This is like a, a long heart like this. And then I'm erasing and then I'm going, I'm erasing and I'm going. And then I, I did these and they were too short and I'm erasing. I don't know. It, it's a process for me, but. Yeah, you have to remember though, what we find is what drives us crazy for perfection. This is perfect for a lot of people. Oh, okay. So <laughs> y'all are so sweet. Yeah. Okay. We're, we'll, we're we'll try cursed and do, with that. We'll try and do. <laughs> I hate it. Everything's always got to be perfect. <laughs> We're so bad, and Eric is a product of his Oh, mom. man. But then okay. I take it to the extremities. Yeah, okay, since I've already taken up so much of your time, friends, I hope that you like what I've done so far. Remember that little silly jar with an egg? 
Look how cute it looks with a tag and a bow. Wouldn't these be cute placed on a table for place, uh, like place cards and, um, or just gifts and stuff? Remember, it looks so plain uh, last live, mm -hmm. but I went ahead and added the bow and the tag and look how cute it looks. It is so pretty. I love it. Is my friend Indiana Jones? Hey, friend, y'all have got to see her video. <laughs> I got to show it to you, Eric. Uh, yeah, I still her, need to check her out. Her video, uh, I think it was, it's a St. Patrick's Day video, and it might have been from last year. I'm not sure, but oh, my goodness. She's so me, and I, I so love her. She's Jacqueline just... Smith said, love meeting you and your mom. Did we meet somebody? Maybe she has meeting somebody. Oh, maybe. Oh, okay. Maybe, yeah, okay. Friends. I'm sorry. I'm I'm yeah. I'm We're I'm fried. Like yes, it is nice I'm to meet everybody. I'm reading. Everybody types and I read, but if she's talking, I try not to interrupt. Yeah, because you know what, people people tell me he needs to quit being so rude, and he's not. I but said that video six years ago. Are you serious? Oh, I just saw it. It was posted for St. Patrick's Day, but I don't care if it's six years ago. You've got to see it. It is hilarious. Visit her channel. Uh, support my friends that support me. I'm so appreciative of y'all. My family just loves everyone. Um, we appreciate you being here with us, and we couldn't make this journey possible without you guys, and we are having a great time. We're not consistent with all our back-to-back uh, -back videos and everything because we stay so busy with our lives. But every chance we can to give you a little something, we try to come on here and give you thanks and appreciation. I'm trying to for... see your earrings. Oh, I've got different earrings on. These are my chick earrings. Somebody asked. Uh, I couldn't find my carrot ones. I fixed them and I had them in my head. <laughs> You know, I suffer from that disease. I didn't know where to put them. But I That's thought, just called ADD. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> anyway, I made these last year, and I have a video for these. Uh, I'm going to make an egg, an Easter egg one. Maybe I'll, I'll have those. Didn't you make that from the matting board? Yeah. No, this from is from same... watercolor paper. Oh, watercolor paper. Uh-huh. Gotcha. So I make a lot of things from different materials because when I'm sharing ideas with you, I want you to know that you can make something on a budget and make it look great and inexpensive. So, I mean, from far away, looking at this, nobody would even think that it's matting board. Look at that. You know, especially when you put it on a wreath or on a garland. Like I said, this is going on a garland. And um, I think I'm going to make some funky eggs to go along with it with the funky dots as well. And, but anyway, friends... We love and appreciate all of y'all. Thank you for joining us tonight. And uh, we will see you next time. Love you, friends. Adios, amigos y amiguitas. Son muy amables. Los quiero mucho. Catch you guys on the next one.